Yes. Oh fuck! I, yeah, I, you you went to it. reach for your Kylo Ren. <laughs> I went to wait, I went to reach for my yes voice button. <laughs> Can you do an analog? Can you do an analog? Yes, man. No, not really. That's all digitally done. Uh, <laughs> How about fuck tingle? <laughs> That's got a low hanging fruit. So does oh. it. <laughs> fuck his, tingle. His name is already Chuck Tingle. <laughs> <sighs> all right. Uh, uh, good uh, show. Uh, Let's pick a name for it. Uh, we've got some. <laughs> Thanks, <laughs> Indians. <laughs> <laughs> we got Manhattan now. Thanks, Indians. <laughs> By the way, your fucking job is shit. Classic. <laughs> I don't know. Where it that was came so from. fucking good. I'm like, where'd you steal that <laughs> from? That shit is perfect. <laughs> Ray Buttbury. <laughs> Philip Cuck Dick. Some of these are just these are just more of these. Um. <laughs> that's how you know you shell silver cunt. Uh, that's <laughs> Salacious code. I just shat in Morse code. <laughs> oh. I kind of like all I want to do is blank, 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 blank. <laughs> That's pretty good. Yeah, I feel that. You feel that, Brian? Do we want to put the words blank or make them? Uh, oh, I do like them as the words. Yeah, the all words I want to do, do is, is blank, 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 in, blank, in all caps, yeah, right? Blank, like blank, 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 blank. Cool. All right, we'll send that out. Oh, good shoe, everybody. <laughs> yeah, we're really sorry. It's pretty great. <laughs> this has been not attack. We're really sorry. <laughs> uh, what, 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 was it funny? Were, were we uh, fiddling our own dicks there? Or, or uh, that felt like that got pretty funny there. Well, it was definitely in, in the DNA of the best ever shows that we've done in like the chat took over for a significant portion of yeah. it. Yeah. Yeah. Fuck Tingle. Uh, uh, fill for a few minutes and it will, maybe we'll play a few more of those. Uh, sure. Oh, hey, also, uh, and I forget to say, uh, or forgot to say it before, but. Uh, oh, did, did, did we keep our new timer? I, I wonder if uh, it, it horrifies me to think that a kid is just like, what the hell is this? New timer? Yeah, we had a first timer in the in the chat oh, at the beginning, right. and, uh, we, and we gave a welcome. And I haven't seen him since. I hope we haven't. Oh, well, he was I your hero. <laughs> hey, by the way, Joe King in the chat says, "Not joking." Great show. Hey. <laughs> uh, oh, I hope it's a girl named Jess kidding. <laughs> Jess? Yeah, no, Jess kidding. <laughs> That's pretty good. Uh. Oh, I was thinking, so uh, for our Patreon name chant corner hour, yeah, it would be awesome if uh, just for that moment, anybody who wanted to subscribe to the show could like subscribe like in that moment while we were doing. Oh, the doing thing. like a t- so, so we could uh, because a lot of the folks have. Uh, Oh, you know what? We'll have a window, and we'll pick no, one. No, yeah, no, just during, like, I, either the Name Jank Hunter Hour, either yeah. we do it as part of it, or it's before or after, but we just, like, for that one moment, we go full, gaudy, yeah. insane, like, in fact, oh, we can have, like, some of the gifts that come in on Fan Made, like, each week as the thing that you get to trigger. Yeah, that's pretty good. I think that's yeah. a good idea. Um, uh, I, I heard half of that. Uh, that sounds uh, like something we can do. Yeah. Uh, basically, we're just looking at a way to turn the spotlight on the engaged folks who are showing up live. <laughs> By the way, Curtis LaRock puts it as live shows being the king, same room shows yes. being next to that, other shows being uh, sub that, and couples that are being, being, being the sub worst. That. Yeah, so not the not worst. T- uh, so the advice was about threesomes, huh? Yeah, it had to be orgy or threesome. Yeah, or I, I thought BDSM because the the set boundaries and look for feelings that are yeah. confusing. Yeah, I, I, if I were you, I would have went with BDSM. Yeah, yeah, BDSM was pretty. Cl- I could see where BDSM was was a part. Of the, the the wording on those was kind of specific in like being, you know, um, what you got a comment on my email? 
No, 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 no. I, I just had a thought. Uh, what if what if we did a different game instead of the name chain Corner Hour, where we pick one at random, we did like a rapid fire thing. We set up a challenge where it's like for 30 seconds, we're going to tick tock, tick tock, and we're going to bet that we could say every single person who subscribes in that window of 30 seconds. Uh, Yeah. No, I'm, I'm into that. That yeah. might be a fun game. Yeah. Um, so we do that, and then we also do the name chain Corner Hour. Yeah, maybe. Yeah. Yeah. Because yeah. yeah. we always want, I mean, sure. Like, we, we don't want to punish somebody. We, the the, the tongueless triathletes deserve to be heard. We want to encourage everybody because Patreon does give us more, you know, juice for our squeeze. Yeah. But Twitch they is all, a, they is all a, is have a to be the same word, platform. huh? Yeah. Ju 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 juice for our squeeze. Yeah. Okay. No. <laughs> uh, all right. You guys want to play a few more of these? Um, yeah. Hit the me. Blanks? Hit me. Fuck yeah. I want to get a chance to win my $20 back. Out of this game. <laughs> Good luck, man. I mean, who knows? Maybe Atomic Blonde really will be the worst colossal disaster. Fucking 50000 God damn it, motherfucker. <laughs> They're like, that's really unusual. Not one person. <laughs> All right, here we go. You're a real, you're, you're <laughs> a real, real piece of work. You're, you're a real blank. <laughs> Uh, this is a pretty tough one. It's <laughs> 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 bad. You're a bad man. Uh, 19 questions from your childhood that have blank blank. 19 what? 19 questions from your childhood that have blank blank. This is uh, a tough. This this I think is a tough. I'm gonna one. say six. I'm going straight to six. Six. Wow. Yeah. What do you think, Justin? I don't know. We, we could play a super cash. Uh, how many? Uh, Brian said six. This is out of nineteen. You know what? Here, we we don't have to compete against each other. I, I'm gonna yeah. say we could do it in six. I'm I'm certain we can. Oh fuck yeah! Go go oh, go! Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, six. Here we go. Um, was the black light test on Room Raiders real? Does black light actually detect bodily fluids? Uh, and again, the the headline is yeah, yeah. questions from your childhood that have blank blank. Uh, terrifying answers. Yeah, I'll go with that. Incorrect. Oh. Uh, why didn't Ariel communicate with Eric by writing things down? She could clearly write her own name. Dumb answers. Dumb answers is incorrect. No answers. No answers is the, is the right ah, answer. Yes. Why couldn't Dill talk like the other babies? What's the difference between CDR and CDRW? Uh, do they actually count votes on TRL? What happened to Arnold's parents on Hey Arnold? Et cetera, et cetera. That, now we're reading about it. Yeah, now we're, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Dangerous and close. That was a good one. That was yeah. good. Uh, 19 reasons why you shouldn't blank in the summer. Uh, after, after blank... Uh, this one, I think the reason I didn't do this one is because this one was kind of precarious. After blank at the beach, the memories will stay with you, but so does the sand. Sex? No. Uh, re read the title one more time. 19 reasons why you shouldn't blank in the summer. Uh, blank in the summer. Tan. No. Incorrect. No. The sea plays by its own rules, and it will embarrass you at all costs. Skinny dip. Incorrect. Uh, you'll probably come out alive, but not necessarily clothed. <laughs> One word? Yeah, 19 reasons why you shouldn't blank in the summer. <clears throat> Skank. <laughs> that's not a... D <laughs> no, like, like the like Scott is. Like oh, uh, sure. Okay. Uh, that's incorrect. It often takes a lifetime to find a swimsuit that actually fits correctly. Diet. Not correct. <laughs> the bathrooms at the beach are always a complete nightmare, so you're forced to improvise. Change? Change your skin? <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, read the title one more time. 19 reasons why you shouldn't blank in the summer. This is this is why I didn't go with this one. This one is a little too wonky. Diet? Uh... <clears throat> right. Uh, here we go. Uh, uh, once you get out, you face a whole other set of problems. And it's uh, associated with enroll in the U.S. military. <laughs> no, I mean it's something about. Uh, uh, yes. uh, Nineteen reasons you shouldn't blank in the summer. Swim. Swim. It's swim. It's swim. Nineteen reasons why you shouldn't swim in the summer. 
It, uh, yeah, the, the, that was kind of a weird That's thing. a dumb... Step up your game, Andrea Hickey. Yo, hey, Andrea Hickey's a fucking hack. All right, no. Uh, <laughs> nope. <laughs> <laughs> Clip it out. Send it to her. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> nope, 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 um, nope, nope. Here you go. Hard Fif- pass. Hard pass. To <laughs> steal a line from the article she just showed us, I'm going to say hard pass. Hard pass yeah. I'm <laughs> just kidding, Andrea. Clip that out and send it to us. We love you, Andrea. You're the best. Love you, Andrea. We want our own Andrea Hickey. Hey, the last time we fucked with somebody, we bought her an iPod. <laughs> <laughs> They're so cheap now, too. I think that was the first time we fucked with somebody. Well, there's always we fucked with a for two. number of them. <laughs> uh, 15 things you want because they're blank, blank. Well, we got a picture here. It's a uh, uh, birdhouse pencil sharpener. Cute AF. They're blank, blank. No, not because they're fucking cute. adorable. No, we'll go to another one here. Uh, oh wait, that wasn't even the first one. That was like the header image. Um, uh, we've got some Pokemon figurines here. Fifteen things you'll want to buy because they're blank. blank. Dumb shit. Your childhood. Incorrect. Um, this is a picture here. <laughs> Are Jewish? Are Jewish? <laughs> Uh, no, I have no. I, no. Uh, I uh, uh, crying uncontrollably. <laughs> <laughs> Terribly lonely. Almost, almost. Um, here we go. This is a finger puppet of a squirrel. It fits in your hand. Wait, <laughs> you stick your finger up that squirrel's asshole. Yeah. I don't know where you put your finger. I don't know yeah. where you put the finger. But Chinese spyware. <laughs> <laughs> this is our smart squirrel finger puppet. Uh, Where did I steal that from? Oh, that's Max Trollbot. <laughs> Here we go. These are plungers that you put on your drink, like drink markers. So cute. No, but I think you're in the in the right direction. So adorable. No. Too adorable. Uh, this is a adorable as Princess Diana the night she died. A rip off of John Armstrong's plunger card trick. Yeah. This is our Jewish. <laughs> <laughs> This desktop sandbox. Um, one more time, the title. Fifteen things you'll want to buy because they're blank, blank. You Tiny th- princelings. Stress reducing. One of those is really close. In fact, um, Tiny princelings. <laughs> is it princelings? Tiny oh. gems. Tiny bubbles. Hitler's <laughs> gym. <laughs> Light fun. I think I think I think that's close enough where I'd probably give it to you. Fifteen things you want to buy because they're teeny tiny. Oh, oh, stop it! It was mostly Hitler's (laughs) shit. It it was teeny tiny. You got a small jar of Nutella. Teeny tiny. Yeah. Oh, look at that little guy. Can I can I can I share? Oh, we didn't get a chance to share like a real moment. Um, Bonnie. We were faking it the whole time. Yeah. (laughs) Bonnie. I know. Had. Just because we made that bet earlier that you were faking it. I'm taking that $20. <laughs> oh, that we bet on whether or not you'd be able to fake it the whole time. <laughs> that was at the top of the I win. I can't believe you got me again, Justin. Um, Bonnie had a moment that literally took her breath away. She uh, got punched in the fucking stomach. <laughs> you got tired of her lip. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like joking about fun. <laughs> oh, whatever. <laughs> um, I heard it. That's fine. I'm um, I'm all right. Don't worry. Check my fucking resume. <laughs> um, Bonnie, I yeah, I'm not even gonna set it up as a mystery. Uh, yeah. Bonnie went to uh the the pharmacy as we've done for 13 years, twice a year, to hand over the life tax to keep our daughter alive. Of five hundred dollars, twice a year. EpiPens. Yes. They they expire every six months. Yes. Oh jeez. Well, we have, we have we have two daughters of differing uh, physical sizes. I, I think they last a year, right? But but they when they cloud, it's like I mean it's your kid's fucking life, right? And sure. Bonnie has witnessed uh, Penny during one of her challenges turn turn gray as a corpse. Oh and, Jesus! And, and like like they jabbed her with the with the epipen. They had to save her life because she failed the challenge. Mm-hmm. Um, and when you see your daughter dying, you take yeah. this very seriously as as well she should. Um, no so other show has this, this is, range for the record. Go ahead. <laughs> this has been this has been a non negotiable. Um, you know, uh, for both Josie and for Penny, you gotta have it. If you right. have if you have like gotta have it, gotta have it up to date. You have to have it. 
Uh, and every single time it's super awkward because we come and they're like, they're like, hey, uh, like, 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 it's always the pharmacist is like walking on eggshells, like, just so you know, it's expensive. Yeah. And I'm like, yeah, I know it's expensive every year. It's six hundred dollars. It's three hundred dollars. You know, and it varies. Yeah, whatever. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Yeah, yeah. Um, Martin Shkreli. Et she went. She went to go pick it up. Yeah. Uh, and bleep blop bloop. And she saw the number, and the guy says, "That'll be five dollars." <gasps> and Holy Bonnie was just like, oh. it was like she had been sucker punched. She's like, what? And then uh, he's like, yeah, yeah, you know, there's generics now. Oh, oh shit! And it was oh like, God. like she almost she teared up, and she was just like, fuck this life giving thing. And and it's like, and it's like, you know, we've had to guilt trip Penny, you know, for like she left a uh, uh, EpiPen in a car, and it got too hot over three days, and it just went bad. That's, Five hundred yeah. down the drain, and so that we had, we had to buy another one. Five dollars, man. Oh my god! And then, and 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 Bonnie immediately is like, something's got to be wrong with it. And I'm like, and I'm like, no, sweetie. No, the generics. generics are made on the same production yep. line yep. by the same company. There's they slap a different label on it. It's yep. fine. Um, yeah. Uh, uh, FLS Carna says that's why they jacked up the price last year. It was going out of patent. Yeah. And 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 there's part of me that understands that I, I'm very I don't know uh, I, I ain't gonna speak to it bums me out that 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 the healthcare system is a political issue now because uh, uh, you know, there there uh, there are gigantic profit motivation problems yes that as I think we are both of similar minds in terms of economic theory like I I that, dig like, the I mean, fact like, that there's huge incentives to save lives well I mean there's a reason why the United States for as laughable as a medical system as like it is it is made to seem has the greatest innovation correct and and you know there, there's a reason why people fly from all over the world to have surgeries in America because there is a certain level of innovation the problem with American healthcare in my opinion is that there are very, very wrong profit motivations. You know, you have uh, insurance companies that are- Well, that that's, yeah, we're, we're, we're veering into political territory. There's no way long, to get around long that. Story yeah, short, yeah, yeah. Long story short, I think that like, anytime that I've had a serious conversation with people about healthcare describing problems, yeah, no one has ever argued with me. Yeah. They've argued with me about solutions, Yeah, but nobody argues with me about they, why the they, problems are there. They argue with you about fault. Yeah. But it's like, in, in in my opinion, like, we could do a lot better, you're right, not making it a political conversation about, like, now we have to wrap, because healthcare was not a complicated enough question. I feel like we should now, save now, this for politics tomorrow. Now we have to wrap it around Donald Trump. Here's all, yeah. uh, that's all I'm saying, is that, like, you're right, because politics is ever-generating. Yeah. Whatever is fucked up now wraps around every issue yeah and and you're right it's annoying that something as important as that has to be wrapped around to that right uh 17 facts about blank blank that will fuck you up donald trump <laughs> molly and ecstasy are essentially the same thing these days what how how does nobody know molly is supposed to be pure crystalline form of mdma but can i can i true, all right here this is molly this is something that i have cocaine, argued with people a lot about. Okay. Who? I have a rant on this. Okay. Oh, yeah. All right. So, Brand, in Brand the 90s. Edition. In the 90s. Yes, folks. We're going all the way back. Mm. <laughs> uh, Millennials are watching Hey Arnold. Nick not knowing what their parent, what happened to his parents. <laughs> <laughs> so, there's a club drug. No one really knows what's in it. Yeah. It's called X or Ecstasy or whatever. It's called Ecstasy. Yeah, yeah. Everybody takes it. They go see the Chemical Brothers mm. and fucking they, they have yeah, a good time. They, they, they rub up on my chest. Yeah. Did I tell you about this? Yes, you did. Mm. And, uh, and also, it wasn't the it was oh, it was the crystal the method. Oh, well, okay. Yeah. Yeah, it was the crystal method. Yeah. That's fine. Them too. <laughs> so now. Oh, because science. They have science in there. Got it. <laughs> <laughs> so now, everybody has a club drug. They take it. Nobody really knows what's in it. Right. They call it Molly. Yeah. And whenever I bring up, yo, no one knew what the fuck was in ecstasy, and you, person who's passionately defending Molly, is taking the word of your drug dealer that it is pure fucking MDMA. Well, as um, 
yeah, I, as far as as from what I understood is is like you had the a, MDMA ecstasy was always uh, MDMA plus something, and it was either a barbiturate or or a, a amphetamine, right? It was either yeah. it was either cut with speed or cut with uh, some kind of uh, opioid. Op- opioid. But, but nah, even then, it, you're talking about two totally different experiences that were all labeled the same thing. thing. Right. Correct. So it could correct. be anything. It yeah. was always a grab. Yeah. Thing. Correct. Yeah. Correct. Yeah. It was uh, always bath salts. <laughs> yeah. I mean, yeah. I mean, yeah. that's, I, I don't know. Uh, 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 so to your point, they're now the same thing. They're they the, are same the same thing. thing. Fine. Okay. Uh, the psychedelic effects of LSD or acid were first discovered when the doctor who created it accidentally got high AF in 1943. And I'm sorry, what is this fact supposed to do to us? Or is that the game? 17 facts about blank blank that will fuck you up. Drug culture. Incorrect. Mm. Cocaine was considered a useful anesthetic in the 1880s. Drug laws. Incorrect. Oh, drug origins. Incorrect. In 1885, Park Davis Pharmaceutical Company started selling cocaine kits, making it super convenient to benefit from cocaine's medicinal properties. They marketed it by saying cocaine can, quote, supply the the place of food, make the coward brave, the silent, eloquent, and render the sufferer insensitive to pain. Drug marketing? Uh, Drug products? No, but that's close. Uh, Oh, Jesus. Can I unclick to spoil Is drug the first word? No. Mm. Years of cocaine use... Is products the second word? (laughs) (laughs) No. Years of cocaine use can and has led to the erosion of tissue around the nasal cavity. Drug... Uh, myths. Lindsay Lohan. No. Uh, it might feel like your brain is melting on magic mushrooms, but studies show they actually increase communication between normally disconnected brain regions. Again, what's the phrasing of the... 17 facts about blank blank that will fuck you up. Party drugs. Party drugs. Ding, 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 ding. Oh! Ah! From Anthony Rivas, BuzzFeed's news reporter. Hey, yeah. Anthony Rivas, great job. Yeah, great report. Clip that Good out, job. send it to Anthony <laughs> Rivas. <laughs> Bill Cosby. Uh, what? <laughs> That's what uh, Max Trollbot wrote in the chat. I wonder if you guys will get this. Okay. I wonder yeah. if you guys will get this. 17 okay. blank, 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 that'll scare the shit out of you. 17 blank, 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 that'll scare the shit out of you. Slit mouthed, slit mouthed. Woman. We're sure it's not all. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm, yeah, I'm with there. All right, go ahead. <laughs> slit mouth. Number one is slit mouthed woman. Uh, internet something stories. Famous surrealist paintings. No, no, no. no, no. It's like th- these are all myths. Japanese myths. No. Three. There are three words. Uh, Japanese anime myths. <laughs> no. There's a Daruma-san, a girl who slipped in a bathtub and gouged her eye out. Japanese ghost stories. Almost. Japanese Japanese ghost. monster tales. Hanako-san, if you knock three times on the third bathroom stall and ask if she's there. Japanese, uh, 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 Bloody Marys. Fuck, fuck sticks. <laughs> you're, you <I>, Our stone <laughs> guards. <laughs> this is tough because I think you're, you're dancing around it. Uh, number four, Onibaba. She's a horrifying monster who shapeshifts. Uh, old wait, woman. hold on. Japanese uh, ghost stories. Close. Uh, Probably Japanese, close enough that I'm, that's what I, I said. Uh, uh, you, Japanese uh, urban legends. Urban legends. Ah. Yeah. Ah. See, uh, we should have been playing this way. All right. I know. <laughs> uh, all right. La- last, last one. Last one. Thirty-seven useful things for the blank person you know. Thirty-seven useful things for the blank person you know. Yeah. Uh, OCD. An adorable mini vacuum to help get rid of all those crumbs that are somehow in your bed. Mmm. And we're sure. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Thirty-seven useful things for the blank person you know. Neat freak. Uh, oh no, high. that's two words. Yeah, there's no hyphen. It's okay. One word. Yeah. Uh, uh, you know what? I, I'll say anal, even though anal is supposed lazy, to be short for anal re- lazy. retentive. Mm, neither of those are quite right. Yeah. Some poor fact mixing bowls that'll allow you to get every bit of batter out uh, without making a total Anal. Mess. And it's not OCD? It's Was it not, anal? Is it anal retentive? It's not quite, no. We, keep, we can keep doing uh, uh, An organizer hanger, because it's about time you gave all your tank tops at home, other than that giant pile of clothes you have on that chair in the corner. Anal. Uh, oh, Other uh, than in that giant pile of clothes you have on that chair in the corner. Lazy? Okay. Mm, 
No, you're, that's in the that's in a better direction. A um, real uh, a real piece of shit. Like someone organized? who hasn't lived up or, their potential. Hold on, organi- hold on. No, uh, organized. 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 Disorganized. Or? Yeah. Mm. A cutting board that grips onto the table so you don't accidentally send it flying. That's a cool. real uh, fucking Ner- nervous. Cunt. Okay, come on, come on. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, this this is kind of weird. I can see why you're getting tripped up. A Clumsy. Of- a pair of eyeliner stencils so you can finally have a freaking straight freaking line and not an everywhere but your eyelid line. And it's like a little cat. Oh, that's cute. Uh, palsy. <laughs> no. <laughs> and I need to calm down. <laughs> um, a hot air brush because messy hair, you want to care versus messy hair, don't care. This is yeah. This is not some of these. These are some of these are not good hints. But like the the nice thing about playing it the way we did is that, assuming you guys didn't just say well, let's do all of them, I could cut some of these very bad ones. Got it. Yeah. Uh, all right. Keep going. A clothes a clothing steamer to help prevent those. I woke up like this in my clothes. Sluts. <laughs> hey girl, is that a clothing steamer in your purse? Or are you just happy to see me? <laughs> Could be steaming your clothes. After Don't think about you that fall asleep in your clothes <laughs> tonight in my house. <laughs> um, here we go. This is this is a good one. I guess the beast could have told that to Bell. <laughs> He's like, "Don't worry, girl. I got you." <laughs> I watched that movie on the way in. Was it any good? Uh, it's the fucking cartoon. I mean, yeah. like, we watch the fucking cartoon. Mm. You had to pretend that fucking Hermione can sing for two hours. Some wine sippy cups because pouring out some for the homies, intentional or not, is totally overrated. Wine sippy cups. This is a very good hint. Seven. White. <laughs> is one of them. Is one of the words white? Thirty-seven useful things for the blank person you know. White. Alcoholic. White. No, not quite. But there is a beer sippy cup next. <laughs> okay. White. Uh, <laughs> Are we sure it's not white? Here we go. Adult bibs having you look super fresh while catching drips and drops. This one's sloppy, sloppy is good enough. That it's sloppiest. So you start, oh, things for the sloppy nice. Oh. It's pretty good. Pretty yeah. good. Synonym pretty good. Pretty good. Synonym for white. Synonym good. for white. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone knows, same thing, same thing. So that's click blank. Someone uh, right before we started, W. Scottus one gave me uh, the good idea to do that with click hole articles or onion articles. Oh my god! Um, oh, frambles, so. bumblers, fingers. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man, well, what do you guys want to do? We actually watched all of our pre-show Ooh, our videos. pre-show videos. We, really? We it. Yeah, we did. Shit, was there anything else that we uh, that we wanted to talk about? Like um, a, a cum or healthcare or something? Do you want to give a two-minute pitch That's on biggest your... range. <laughs> biggest range of any program. <laughs> Nobody. Take that to the bank, Nobody. Man. You tried, Nobody. You try to come. Nobody. At our cum. You want fucking my brother and, bro- my brother and me to make a Jocelyn Elders <laughs> fucking <laughs> joke? Huh? Huh? Uh, do you want to give like the two-minute story of your drone encounter, Brian? Or do you think you got Oh, it? Uh, well, I, I think we yeah, right, we, we can summarize that. Start that. Bit. I'm going to pee, and then I'll come in for the punchline. Uh, okay. <laughs> right. uh, uh, basically, I yelled at a neighbor. Um, the, uh, we uh, were practicing out in the in the public space behind your house. Yeah. And, uh, and someone um, took shots. Well, and, and, and what's funny is it was it was uh, Murphy that was just like, I think somebody's shooting at your drone. Yeah. And, and I'm it like. It sound like a gun. It wasn't a gunshot, clearly, but it sounded like either. It was an air. It, you could tell it was the sound of an air rifle and you could hear the clack you know, clack clip. of the quadruple pumping they were doing. Right. But but what's funny is I dismissed it out of hand because it sounded like the same thing to me. But I thought there is no fucking way I live in a neighborhood where anyone would look up at a multi-thousand dollar piece of photography equipment mm. and think I should have the right to shoot that thing out of the sky. Like that was so absurd and insane to me that there was no way that that was, that was the case. Um, and then sure enough, and it wasn't until uh, um, I stood up on the, the banister and looked over at the uh, common area and sure enough, a hundred feet away, uh, 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 dad and his son, it appeared to be. Uh, I, yeah. I keep saying a dad and his son. Are we? How sure of that are we? Do we I, know? I didn't actually see them, so I can't. I can't even say. Yeah. Um, but I, I felt exact. I felt the same way of like. I mean, that does sound like a pellet gun or something, but I can't. Um, I, I, I like to think you live in a pretty nice neighborhood that maybe wouldn't 
just start shooting at stuff that they well, see. And that that was the part that broke my mind, right? Is like we're clearly in a neighborhood beholden to covenants, and it's like and and yes, I understand if you are are you know way the fuck out of the sticks and you know you've got five acres and clearly somebody's invading on one of them then yeah by all means bust out the shotgun shoot it down that's you know uh i mean assuming that's within your rights um but uh the the weird part for me was looking over at uh god damn it (laughs) <laughs> um, the weird part I have, a, for me. I have a funny story about this photo after this I have a funny story about this photo okay uh well oh, I anyway to. I look over and it's like and and in this panic I'm like um on the, there's a million things that occur to you to say in that moment but all I know is I have to do something that will cause them not to take another shot that might hit that 4k camera right and, and uh, so you climb on the on the the ledge, and and, and I and I just shout, uh, which by the way, this is one of those, um, you know, there's certain phrases that even though they're not curse words, they just roll off the tongue, and they really feel good. Like 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 garbage is one of those where you're like this shit is garbage. This yeah. is garbage. Uh, the other one is is um, is just shouting as I did this time. I was like, hey, assholes, knock it off. And then there was a uh, uh, the knock it off. Um, yeah. There was that pregnant pause, and this this freezing as everybody evaluated what's going on. And I decided that apparently there needed to be a little more prodding, and and I I can't remember exactly what I said, but I'm pretty sure it was along the lines of uh, 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 knock it off, or I'll call the or I'm or, you know, like or I could call the cops. You yeah. choose. I did something like that. Something like that. Um, okay, so we, we showed this Photoshop of, of the picture of me that's been making the rounds. Um, uh, it, it's, this is a photo that I took in like college. Like I took this photo along with a bunch of other similar photos. The very first day I got my DSLR camera that shoots video. Oh, so and you wanted, wait, so this was all just a video run and you pulled out a, a still frame or? Uh, not even that, it was, um, it, it was all photos. At the time, I, they were just photos I was doing. I want to see if I have any of them, but I think I just have that one because I like that one the best. Um, but uh, it's, By the way, if you haven't seen it, it's, 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 it's fine composition. You're downlit, and you could tell this is – I bet it was pretty amazing to see this photo – when you're going from you know camera phones or whatever to to, a, to like a true decent good camera, yeah, and like I uh, I was I, you know I was doing this on my bed in my little apartment, and I have one of those big lanterns like the one we the one we used to have up here, up in here, and so in all of the photos or mo- almost all of them. Uh, you can only see one hand because my other hand is like aiming the light. At also, me. Uh, no. uh, to describe the photo, also uh, slightly more erotic than you would expect from a business email um, sure. avatar, uh, which didn't stop you from wearing it as such. Uh, wait. <laughs> yes, I know it's my. I think it's still my Skype icon. Um, <laughs> but uh, so this photo that I took, there exists not one, but two paintings of it. Paintings? Paintings of it. There's paintings? Really now. And one of them is in my possession. What? Where did, where, what happened? Uh, my grandmother. Your grand? What? Who, who uh, is, was getting into and is, is doing very well as a painter. Abuela? <laughs> no, the white one. The white one. Oh, okay. Uh, painted painted this, this picture. She was like, oh, and, I, and then I think she won some little... Uh, uh, Art competition with the photo, or with the with the painting. Oh so, can no! We, we've, we've got to see the painting. Give, give me a few minutes to see if I can look it oh, up. Oh my it, word! It, it's probably on Facebook, but I don't want to dox my grandpa. <laughs> if I can help it. I don't want to dox my grandma. <laughs> title of the episode. Too late. Too late. Uh oh. Wait, oh is this my a god. third one? Oh, oh my sh- god. This is a third one. I haven't even seen this one before. Wait, there's a third? Oh, she's doing a series of these? No, this is just another one of them. She, This one's square. The other ones were, like, uh, rectangular. This was 2015. Yeah, I, this was after I You look like a two. pig. <laughs> <laughs> you look like uh, 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 Herbert. <laughs> yeah, the, uh... You should put a cork in your nose. <laughs> Let me see if the other one. It, it was one of her first ones, so she might not have. No, that's posted, fucking but. amazing. Like, I, 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 yeah. I, I don't mean for her only words to be crossed. Like, fucking that shit was great. Yeah. Your grandma can fucking paint. Yeah. So, uh, apparently now there are three. Man, getting around. Uh, so wait a minute. Uh, 
w- where are you on all this? Because like, like uh, I mean, you, I've you, always, you, I, uh, yeah. You posted this shit. Sure, sure, sure. And now people are painting about it. That should be a rad. That's awesome. But you're playing it off as like, oh, I don't know. I mean, this. Well, is I mean, his thing- grandmother's painting it, which is a little bit yeah different. Hey. And it and it is a very. Um, I I'm like the- in my early 20s in beautiful photo. <laughs> it is Photoshop. Yeah. Ah, here we go. Uh, Brian immediately keys on the youth. <laughs> well, like, you are showing off. You are <laughs> flaunting your youth. If, if I, and for the record, man, if I had decent DSLR co- equipment and mm-hmm. I was under 25, uh, it would be a hell of a lot. Of, of this shit, I'd be uh, 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 wincing at as you've showed on the show. Well, I I still like the. Fo- I think it's a. I think it's a very nice photo. It's it is the very recent association with that, and the, that makes me wet line. That is is, uh, ironically those those are from very similar time periods. But the association of those two things is kind of weird to me. What but, do you mean? Wait a minute. That's uh, old though. That picture. Sure, they're both old. That line is old too. Oh really? It's. It's only it's like a year or so, or no, a couple years, a year or two after that. Wait, so that was a callback when you said it a couple like I didn't weeks say it. Ago? We watched it in a video from my old podcast. Oh yeah, oh, that's yeah, right. you thought he just said it. Oh, yeah, gotcha, yeah, 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 yeah. 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 Um, I forgot where that came from. Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, that was what? No, that was, a, was the 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 executives the or executives? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Anyway, uh, what else we got? Are, 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 are we are we overstretching at this point? We got nothing. Oh, was there anything good on the videos that? Uh, um, let me. S- do we do we have out. a channel on Discord that's just videos? We do. It is the um, uh, the watching the viewing room. The viewing room is just videos. We can pull some stuff from here. Um, oh, geez. Uh, how a son made a chatbot of his dying dad. Nope. Are we interested uh, in that? Uh, yeah, pass. Okay, pass. we're gonna do a hard pass. Oh, here we go. We watch this. At the very start, uh, we got a the three card monty. The magic cards. We don't need to hear audio on that. No uh, editing, no CGI. Oh, this is the uh, princess card trick. I don't know. Uh, you have to pick one of these, and then uh, something changes. Let's see. Yeah, I saw this shit on fucking you know Windows ninety five. Yeah. Uh, we're supposed to pick one. No. Okay. But can you tell from what you're seeing now what it is? Um. No. Uh, knowing knowing Richard Wiseman, um, I'm gonna guess that you know he's a big fan of using force perspective stuff. Mm-hmm. So I wonder if if that's what's going on. Something shifts as. So they blink. Wait. Oh. Oh. So so he says there's no CGI or whatever. Right. Uh. Oh. Oh my. That's very impressive because it appears to instantly flash. So they flashed it all the aces. Man. Uh, oh, wow. Oh, oh, it's an advertisement. Oh, he laid out four it's proje- black cards. It's, yeah. it's projected. And so he does the flip so that you don't see it. Yeah. That's a bit That's a bit of a stretch on no CGI. Since the technically it's computer since graphics. definitely it's the literal definition of computer gener- generated imagery, <laughs> like and then he goes on to show use After Effects yeah like fucking yeah. this shit is After Effects as fuck but it's the wrong After Effects uh, you were looking in the wrong place oh okay we have to watch this 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 this is only a minute uh this is this is a, a cool weird sort of thing this is uh, Henke Shoujo. Well, finally, fuck, we're getting to this. Oh, uh, this lovely lady. Big eyes anime. Summer. Girl with the flower hat. Oh, no, it's fine away. Beautiful summer day in the breeze. What the fuck? Leave it to me. This chick in a sailor outfit flies up. Sailor oh, she's going to get it for her. Oh, no, she can't. <laughs> Jesus Christ, she turned into a... She destroyed her body and just robot up in oh, her ass. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> I've never wanted a fucking airplane more than just right now. She turned into a fighter jet. <laughs> oh, god damn. <laughs> she flies away. 
<laughs> God damn. So, on God, a... I would be so confused all the time. Never Japan. change, Japan. Never. <laughs> Never change. God damn. Oh. Let's see. Um... Let's see. Da, da, da. Oh, this is great. You've seen this, right? The... These are cats. I have not seen this. Who have been taught to ring a bell for food. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> you're like fuck it. Maybe your bell works. Mine doesn't. <laughs> yeah. Corgi Miku pedal. So, oh Jesus, this is 15 minutes. Do they have a demo? Hmm. Uh, that's very long. The funniest petty pedal review ever. Yeah, you might have seen other pedal reviews that have been shorter and funnier. <laughs> but you've well, never guess seen what? this. No the way. longest pedal review ever. I Chapel Hill Teen has won bragging rights in the snack world as the owner of what could be the largest Cheeto on earth. WB22's Rick Swiner sat down with the teen to check out his eBay bargain. 15-year-old Nick Robinson Whoa. is an average teenager. He's into computers, music, video games, and Cheetos. Pause Cheetos. this. Not this is eat. definitely this is like the Nick Robinson. This computer. Wait, is that actually Nick? That's actually Nick Robinson. What the <laughs> You're fuck? You're going to collect all thanks to eBay. I saw it on a message board on the internet. Someone said, look at this. This is the world's largest Cheeto. And I checked it out, and I expect, you know, like these strange items typically do to get it in the, like, the hundreds of dollars. And I just bid, like, as a joke for fun, like, three bucks on it. And apparently this is an auction that never took off. Nobody really noticed it, so it, I accidentally won this auction. If you don't think a big Cheeto's a big deal, think again. This is your average Cheeto here. Not too impressive once you put it next to Nick's big find. <laughs> More like cheese puff piece, am I right? A cheese puff piece! This Man. Cheeto isn't Nick's only eBay acquisition. It's in fact, now. the rising right. Northwood High School fat ass Cheeto. He loves collecting video game promo pieces from the auction site. Nick's father, who's also <laughs> named Nick, says the size is impressive. The thing the that strange patience that is reading all you know, how how over his face is extraordinary. Cheeto. Nick says he only paid about six bucks for the nugget, including shipping. He says he hasn't decided what to do with the orange mound of goodness yet. But he says whatever he does, it'll probably be cheesy. Rick Swiner, WB22 News at 10. I love and hate every single inch of that. <laughs> did uh, did you see the uh, the last week tonight with John Oliver piece about the mega corporation that's buying up all the local news stations and like oh the, Sinclair? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, and, yeah. And the and the the pieces, the commentary pieces that that are called the the must runs that they send to everyone mm. and how many people they reach compared uh, compared like I I I I I've not seen the last week tonight thing but I am familiar with Sinclair. We'll, yeah. we'll we'll I will rewatch all 20 minutes of it again just for the the astonishing uh in fact you might be able to just Poke I mean, in I, and I, find I, some of the I, stuff I, that they put in there. I, I, I mean, understanding that they are who they are. I mean, like, like they were the guys that Swift Boat. Like that, that yes. was like the whole Swift yes. Boat. Yes. Thing. Like, well, and now they own more eyeballs than CNN or Fox News. In a dying medium. Uh, yes. Well, yes, but again, uh, that that that's one of the. I mean, you you could live in future land, but for right now land, they are they are they are sending out messages that are. In a in a very real measurable way affecting the entire country's perceptions. This is very sure. This is very related to nobody speak. Uh, this is basically the topic that nobody speak. The documentary talk touches on. Yes, uh, and, which, I, and I and I've watched neither, so I yeah. am yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I, I am uninformed. Yeah. Um. Well, uh, let's get you learned on how to find if someone's gay. Oh, thank you. Yeah, and that's how finally, my mom the real story. finally got out of jail. Wow. Oh my god, this guy lives in my building and he's so cute and I can never tell if he's gay or not. I can find out. Hey! Oh hey, what's up? Come here. What's going on? I really like your shoes. Oh thanks, I love that top. Oh my god, thank you. Fashion. Fashion. You into that? You gay? Ha <laughs> <laughs> 
Okay. You into well, that? I mean, what, you what's gay? gay? What's funny is, I mean, it's half right. Like, just ask, <laughs> you know. But, but also, I mean, are you into that? <laughs> Maybe. Yeah, yeah. You, you gay? gay? Did we ever watch the crunch? The ex- did Did yeah, we ever? Yeah, watch? yeah. I, okay. wa- I I watched this, and we we referred to it in the uh, the you had an dot Dexpo. Yeah. Have you seen this, Justin? The crunch from E three E three. I have not. Meme. No. So from no, us no, no. for the Xbox E three twenty seventeen press conference. Uh, obviously, this so is this, the very uh, first real big this game publisher a uh, press conference thing of E <laughs> three. Um, oh, oh wait, come, the whole like eat a tuned. banana thing. Uh, we've got like, yeah, tomorrow, at, we've got without hands-on impressions it. coming. All sorts of gameplay stuff. Just really run of the mill traditional. God, I'm gagging. Hands looking at that because all I can picture is the fridge <laughs> for you to that enjoy. Tendril down the throat. Stay tuned. Yeah. Yeah. The... Remember to subscribe, and you can tune in to our YouTube channel or Polygon.com. We're also available on Apple News. You can subscribe <laughs> on iTunes, I think, or Stitcher, and you can. We've got a great Facebook page you can check out there. We're doing posts Very good. daily on there. Yeah. <laughs> uh, are you okay? It's so bad. <laughs> That's that dude who sold that Cheeto, That's right? That's the Cheeto kid. Yeah. That's the che- <laughs> I bought that Cheeto. Are you kidding me? I bought that Cheeto. Yeah. I, mean, I don't know. Maybe he sold it. Who knows? Man, Who knows? nobody sells Cheeto. It's the best. You get a Cheeto in your life, you hold on to that Cheeto. You treat that Cheeto better than you treated any other Cheeto in your That's life. That's a fact. That's a goddamn fact. Yeah. What the? Uh, uh, what am I looking at there? That yeah. is an episode of the NSFW show. Yeah, but why does it? Okay, hold on. Look at that thumbnail. Uh, That's no. Okay, that thumbnail to me looks like Scott Johnson's face mapped on to Justin Robert Young's body. Circa what, what year? That would be oh, if that was Glape. Twenty twelve, twenty thirteen. Wait, is that Scott Johnson? That is that. Yeah, that's definitely got to be Scott Johnson. But he's sitting on the weird he's thing never, set, yeah, and he's on my it's body. Because <laughs> he was on that episode. <laughs> this is very confusing to me. <laughs> Just play where it goes. Where does it go? This is uh I'm, I'm calling this right now. There's no way this is real. There is no way this is real. Oh there my is God. no way this oh, is Africola. real. Oh, Africola. Well, there, there's a guy in a, in a Okay, true story. Can you pause this? Mm-hmm. I had to move out of my apartment that night. I I, I literally flew really? to Oakland the next day and you were in some. That seems TV like a million thing. years ago. You were in some TV thing, and I wound up staying up talking to you for like another two hours after the fucking show. And I thought I was gonna like clean my room and then just like pack up my bed and shit uh, the next day. Yeah, I ran out of time and literally was cleaning right up until I drove all my shit to my parents' house and then went to sleep. For a couple hours before I fucking got on the flight later that day. Wow. This is November 2011. Yeah. Yeah, that was our Thanksgiving jamboree. That's right. That's right. But why does the thumbnail look like... Because somebody photoshopped some shit. I yeah, know. I'm sure that's like... It's like a bit something or something. from the yeah. billboard or okay. something. Some Photoshop. That was really Who knows? Weird. Africola, true, though. True fact. That he he so left the next up. day. <laughs> yeah, he quit his apartment the next day. Um... Is that it? Yeah, I think so. I think so. Are we we Dirk's ruled? Yeah, I think so. Dirk's rules are comfortable. That's that's a good soma to to wind everything up, right? Hey, listen, it's three in a row. Hits, yeah. Party's over. That's right. Uh, Thank you everybody for coming to the stream. Come and watch the thing. Hey man, you guys are the best. Thank you for all of the amazing pornography, twenty first or twentieth century science fiction writer. Oh, oh wait, hold okay. on, wait, let's hold play, on. Let's play. Uh, uh, that reminded me of something we watched in the pre-show. I'm going to not show it on screen because the people saw what they could see. Uh, I just want to see your reactions on this. All right, uh, Bosley. Uh, Sandwich Brad said that uh, the Auntie Donna boys need our help, so I don't know if. Uh, uh, let's get Mr. Mustache to hundred thousand views. That a, it's probably a YouTube. Well, is that that like a uh, like a thing? Oh, hello there. My name is Mr. Mustache Man, and I've got a big sale on today at Karen Downs. 
Uh, I've got a big thing of moustaches, and if you want a moustache, like, I love moustaches. Uh, someone said to me, it was 1972, and they said, I want a moustache. And I said, well, is it, you need a specialty store in Caron Downs. Here I am, have on a little laugh. And the best thing about this is you can take that moustache off and put it back in the box. My name is Mr. Moustache Man. Um, this is my friend Broden. He um, he he gets a bit mad sometimes and, and, and taps me on the sack. This here is Mark Bonanno. He's uh, he 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 doesn't work for us anymore, unfortunately, um, because he was convicted of. Uh, okay, here we are. This is Mr. Moustache Man. I like to sell moustaches. Twenty dollars for moustaches, and it's going to really blow your mind how many moustaches I've got. And there's so many moustaches that there's now two Mr. Moustache Man. Here's Mr. Moustache Man number one, and Mr. Moustache Man number two. Now let's have a think about uh, ways that you can make friends. One way is with some moustaches. This is the old west moustache. It's a big moustache and I like to use it to impress the ladies at the, at the Revolver nightclub. I go into the city on a Sunday night. I go to Revolver nightclub and I f- Twenty dollars here for the Mr. Mustache mustache. Uh, this this little mustache is a, is a big boss mustache. I'm a the big boss, one. and I love to make a, all my friends. Oh no, I fell off. It's the same footage <laughs> of the same one. This is the mustache man. If you come in with seventeen ninety five, I'm going to say the lowest price is twenty dollars. If you come in with a smile and a quick in your step, I'm going to give you a mustache for seventeen ninety five. That's probably the lowest I could go. We do mustaches. You're Mr. Mustache and Co. We do mustaches and that and fish food. Sixteen dollars is going to get you two mustaches and a fish food. And that's what it's really all about. I'm having a little dance because I'm so excited about all the mustaches that I have to sell at the Mr. Mustache Emporium. 16.52. Best thing about my mustaches is you can add them. <laughs> Look at me go. I love to add mustaches for breakfast and dinner. Uh-oh. Here it comes. A little mustache egg. Mr. Mustache Man loves mustaches so much he even gives himself a little kiss when he gets a mustache. Ah, oh, hello, Mr. Mustache Man. Kiss, 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 kiss. Oh, you're so good at kissing, Mr. Mustache Man. Ooh, a lot. This French mademoiselle has discovered a man with a mustache, and she is ready for love. Gives him a little kiss and thinks to herself, I must buy him some more mustaches after the wedding. I love mustaches, and my wife Sun Lee loves mustaches too. Hey, can I, can I level with you guys right now? I don't like mustaches. <laughs> I'm in it for the mustache coin. Mr. Mustache Man, $17 for a mustache, $18 for a mustache. Mr. Mustache Man, I'm going to have a little bit of a five divine, put it in the I mean, they always wear me down, right? It's like, like it starts and I'm just like, Oh no! This one's gonna be stop it, boy. Too you simple. Stop it right this one's now. too simple a conceit. You can't get me to laugh at this one. Mm. Uh, we saw this in the pre-show. So if you're listening, you, you probably know. I'm not gonna show this on screen because I can't. Mm. I just want you guys to watch this. Oh my, oh my god! god. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> what subreddit do you think she's on? <laughs> Um, in any case. Oh wait, hang on. What's uh? You can leave that on. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, How is that on YouTube? Well, I think they have a well, policy art. about like all nipples are equal. No, there's the there's a subreddit itself. of stuff that's made it through the the porn filters for whatever reason. Like it just uh, uh it's not in trouble yet. The art speaks for itself. Nine eleven tits. I Why mean, do straight men devote so much headspace to those big, bulbous bags of fat drooping from women's chests? Scientists have never satisfactorily explained men's curious breast fixation, but theorists, theorists are going to theorize. Is that an actual tattoo or just a drawing? I mean, who knows? I don't know. <laughs> what, are, are you a 9-11 tits truther? <laughs> <laughs> Titser? Um, uh... Okay, there, there's a there's a subreddit called, uh, and it's just a bunch of letters. Somebody could put it in the chat, but it's basically um, uh, 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 
uh, it, like basically it says good video <laughs> that has a girl in it. It's it's a little distracting. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Good video that has a girl in it. Uh, that. Uh, don't click just for the video, although I clicked on it just for the girl or something, something like that. Like, yeah. um, uh, God damn it, somebody can find it. <sighs> is it on Titty Conspiracy? Yeah. Is that a subreddit? <laughs> yeah. Titty Conspiracy? Breaking uh, news. Brian. Brian but Brian. yeah, by the way, well, what is the subreddit where uh, all the uh, non porn filtered shit comes through? I don't know. I only heard about it like yesterday. Um, From who? From the playground. Your subconscious? <sighs> From my own imagination, I'm wishing for it to be true. Uh, I, I would say like bo- boober, you, uh, uh, uber, bo- boober tube or something. Boob tube. Something. Oh, there it is. There it is. Uh, uh, Reddit.com slash r slash capital u n b g b b i i v c h i d c t i i c b g. Upvoted not because girl, but because it is very cool. However, I do concede that I initially clicked because girl. Oh. <laughs> and it's just all good videos that happen to have a chick in them. And are probably likely the reason many people discover them. Yeah, all right. These are some badass photos. Right? They're all legitimately awesome. Oh, shit. Look at that chick go. She's climbing. She's climbing the target. Some dance moves here. Oh damn! Oh shit! That's jitterbugging. Get it, girl. Get it, girl. Uh, God damn! Uh, uh, uh. Look at that. That's some white people shit. God damn, man. <laughs> white people used to know how to dance. We have forgotten. <laughs> we have forgot. Now, let me tell you something, you cocksucker. White people used to be able to dance like you wouldn't believe. I'd walk out of my apartment on Venice Beach, high as a kite and jitterbugging as far as the eye could see. Well, I remember. Back in the day, they used to be saw cops. Yeah, cocksucker. <laughs> saw cops were boys and girls. They didn't stick on the other ends of the hallway, right? They were just there dancing, they jitterbugging together. They weren't texting each other. They were they were full on simulating fellatio. <laughs> All right, we were calling it. Uh, I don't know, man. I could dive into this all night long. These are great videos. It's just me and Brian doing Ian McShane impression. (laughs) Watching watching. viral videos. Animated GIFs, even. That's pretty cool. Cool hair color. Mm. Uh, Dancing with a security guard. That's... Definitely what's happening. Has anyone I mean, is that wait, wait, wait scroll scroll back up. Is that a quick change thing? Like like has anyone done that with quick change? I'm sure. Uh, uh it, or hair not, dyed? Dyed hair? Uh well specifically this split down the middle look. Uh, yeah. uh the first time I'd seen it is one girl had dyed uh half of her hair blonde and the other half was brown. Yeah. So so she went from like uh uh, uh from punk teen to girl next door or back back in a, in a magic act. Uh no. Oh. Just on the video. I don't think I've seen it in... It seems like somebody should take advantage of that for the magic guy. I mean, that's the thing. It's like, like you know... That's got to be the frustrating Dude, part about magic. Dude, dancing on a table. Oh, well, shit! Sure. Like a big pizza pie. Right? Oh, god damn. Stop this. That's I mean, just these, pornography. These are, wait, what do you mean? A girl fiddling with a gun? Oh, and do, doing the fucking gun baton. Like, I mean, come on. In in, in the in the, wait, the there's a truck in the background. The field <laughs> and the truck. Stop it. That's a fucking it's Toby propaganda Keith video. Propaganda. He's our president too. Uh, oh, her hair oh my god! Look at her like, hair. Being like blown away oh by the god. face waves. A uh, girl trains cow to do horse tricks when she's not allowed to have no a horse. Way. Oh my god, she did! She trained a fucking cow! When Look at her! I'm a reporter for Inside Edition. <laughs> Once upon a time, this chick saw a Syriac video with the cows and thought, I don't know, let's drive them around. And then I lost my ambition, so I work at Inside Edition. It even rhymes, that's why I said it that way. <laughs> What do you Barbara mean to Walter. play us out? <laughs> to play us out. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking thing sucks. <laughs> <laughs> no, fuck it. I'll write it. Yeah. We'll do it live. I'm not ashamed to admit. I thought I'd get a Pulitzer. But here I am at Inside Edition. 
Scott can clear an impressive five-foot-high jump, but Hannah says only when she feels like it. Now that is definitely a horse of a different color. It's a cow. Inside edition <laughs> oh boy. Jesus. All right. Uh, one more time, that URL. Uh, Reddit.com slash r slash u in B G B B I I V C H I D C T I I C B G. It's the best subreddit on the, the Reddits. Holy shit. Yeah, there's a uh, woman doing all sorts of upside Listen, down. Listen, I. Ball I I'm not going to say that my professional conduct has ruined my Reddit experience, <laughs> but like I now have to subscribe to political Reddits because oh, I want to keep up on shit. Yeah. And there's one Reddit, and I won't name them, but they have an underscore between the two words. <laughs> the and Donald. Uh, <laughs> that, like, I don't know what fucking kind of, like, magic they're using. But they have gamed the fucking algorithm to a point where it dominates 90% of my Of your feed? feed? Oh. oh and so I, uns I, I, I unsubscribed for a while because I was just like, like, like I, I just can we don't just want clarify? I'd like to still enjoy Reddit. Like, yeah, I mean, sure. I just don't want 90% of it. Yeah, filter it in where it's cool, but like, right. understand. Yeah. I mean, that's the, that's the thing is you can't, like... The best way to experience Reddit is to make an account and turn off all of those default things and just find the littler things that you like. Yeah, but the problem is, like, I, I actually use it as a way to collect political opinions because I want, like, because nobody else is going to shout out fucking, like, you know, our politics or the underscore Donald, which are, like, in watching them on the opposite end of their political spectrum, sub. right? Mm -hmm. Uh so I'm the guy. I'm the Reddit political guy. Okay. Yeah, so yeah. I got to watch them because I got to know what they're talking about so I can give my conversation on what they're talking about. Those two specifically. Yeah. And I can't do that fucking comfortably when like the underscore Donald is just like spamming fucking everything. Yeah. Every yeah. post is just so... and. I, I'm not going to say spamming is in there doing it illegally. Yes, maybe they are so. But the size of it and the Hashtag high energy. But it's like, yeah. and I mean, I follow subreddits with bigger followings mm -hmm. that, for whatever reason, don't dominate my fucking feed. And T2 has, has it that they use stiggies and targeted upvoting so that when there is new stuff, they say, okay, this is what we're... We're pushing. pushing. And by the way, we're the worst people on the fucking planet to ever criticize that because it's literally the t the tact that we have done to have our greatest successes, right? Yeah. Is like finding the soft spot in the algorithm and then exploiting it. Yeah. Have you tried? Uh, uh, TG makes a, a good point. You can have, um, you can basically make what? Are, what are they called? Lists of subreddits. Yeah, you can make lists. So you could say, here's my political list, and bookmark that. And then here's my everything else and bookmark that. That's so much harder than just going to Reddit and seeing what I need to see. At Which is also kind of the purpose of Reddit. To, to, yeah. to have a list curated and everything and to get you the stuff. But, mm, yeah. No, 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 no. Listen, it, it, it's right that they have lists. And yes, it is me being an old person not wanting to like spend more time on Reddit. Right. Yeah. But dad, at, I know. But I guess at, at, at the end of the day, it's either I follow them and they ruin my feed, mm -hmm. or I don't follow them and I have to go to their site. I have to click Manually. again yeah. every time. Have you tried? Have you considered one account on your computer, one account on your phone? If it were easy enough to throw it into a, a sheets like link or whatever like into the right sheet i would do it mm. but that's really why i look at them is so i can put them into the politics 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 sheet yeah so i can then talk about it on the on the on the show or whatever. Mm. all right wrapping it up yeah all Love right you guys good night XOXO. everybody see you later